A woman in Florence has made it a goal of hers to help women grieve and heal after being the victim of human trafficking. Way 31's Matt Pasquitt spoke to the founder of Holo's Hope to learn more about the origins of this nonprofit. Amy Doherty Thompson says she's had a passion for helping victims of human trafficking since she was just a teenager. And now that dream became a reality one year ago when she was able to open Holo's Hope here in Florence. They're amazing women. They have blessed my life in numerous ways, for sure. Helping those in need has always been on Amy Doherty Thompson's mind. After spending years as a counselor in Florence, she decided she wanted to take the next step. I just really felt like God was turning a passion into a purpose and felt called to open a very holistic program for survivors of human trafficking. According to the U.S. Department of State, more than 27 million people worldwide are current victims of human trafficking. Doherty Thompson says she recognized it happening here in Alabama, but there were not a lot of resources available for victims. With about 300,000 plus victims here in the U.S., there was about, I think, 2,800 beds available. So there was a huge need for survivors coming out of the trafficking, you know, a place for them to stay and get rehabilitated. Polo's Hope was then founded, giving women a place to stay and grow while recovering from traumatic experiences. We wanted it to be different than just, you know, putting a roof over their head and giving them food and just basic necessities where they were really finding their purpose and finding freedom and hope and healing. And so it's a full two year program and that it's completely free. The four women currently living at the home receive free medical and dental care and are able to get access to educational opportunities. Along with receiving one on one counseling, they also have therapy with horses. They have connected with the horses on a, a level that's really hard to describe. While Holo's Hope has only been open for a little more than a year, Doherty Thompson says this is something she wants to do for the rest of her life. If we can help one woman at a time, you know, her life has been changed forever. So that's our goal, it's just one woman at a time. Reporting in Florence, Matt Paskowitz, Wait 31 News. Hello's Hope is hosting their second annual Fight for Freedom on Saturday, August 12th. It's at 7 p.m. at the Shoals Marriott Conference Center that's in Florence. 